It's that time again for the Spassin Hall Morning Show. Spussard Hailing Gabers. Gabers, who wrote this script? Let's try this again. Hello, Spussard Hailing Gators. I'm Gus. And I'm Anna. And we're reporting from our own playground. Today's day is Friday, January 28th, 2011. Let's go see Kirby and Birdie for the lunch menu. B -b Birdie, please tell me we are not having ch ch chicken for lunch. Just chill. I understand your concern, Kirby. Today for lunch, we are having, yay, no chicken. It is pizza day with corn, Popeye salad, applesauce, and of course, milk! Mmm, sounds great. I imagine Kevon Martin in Miss Durham's third grade class eats healthy foods like that because he is our athlete of the week. Woo, Kevon Martin! Anna, throw the football to me. Are you sure you can catch it? How hard can it be? Okay. Maybe we should leave playing football to the professionals. You go check on the sports and I'll go check on Gus. What are you doing? I heard we were talking about the Super Bowl and this is the biggest bowl I could find. You're confused. The Super Bowl is the championship game. For today's sports update, the Super Bowl is coming up and that means that the Pittsburgh Steelers are going against the Green Bay Packers. Also, on January 30th, the Pro Bowl will be held. And that means that the AFC's best players will go up against the NFC's best players. Can we still use the big bowl? I guess we can use it for popcorn. Oh yeah. Back to you in the studio. Hey guys, you know, playing sports often requires using a ball. You're right. Adair is going to show us a humongous ball. Humongous? What does that mean? Watch and see. Hi Gators, today's word of the day is humongous. You what? Humongous, it means to be exceptionally large or huge. Okay, so I could say in a sentence that this basketball is humongous. Actually, I wouldn't say that this basketball is humongous. Tell me humongous. Are you sure? Yeah, bring it on. Okay, Joe, show us what a humongous ball looks like. All right, bring in the ball. What? No! Ball! I think Joe needs to go to the clinic. I think he has a humongous headache. Woo, poor Joe. This job can be dangerous. Don't worry, guys. I think it's going to be a beautiful day outside. I hope so. Let's check out the weather forecast for today. Gators, Perfect Pete here with your perfect weather forecast. I guarantee we will have a beautiful day. The current temperature is 75 degrees with no chance of rain. Alex is outside reporting live. Alex, isn't it nice outside today? Well, there is a brief wind, and I do feel a few raindrops. Oh, you can count on me when I tell you there's no chance for rain. There's water falling from the sky! Maybe we are going to have a few brief showers, but the sunshine will come out again very soon. But I think I see an electrical storm coming. I'm really looking forward for the sunshine. Back to you and Gus in the studio. Those little rain showers look pretty intense. That happens here sometimes in the south. Watch this to learn more about the south and the other directions. Gators, did you know that the four cardinal directions are north, east, 
south and west? Morris is directly above me. Morris, what is your direction? I am north of you. N is for north. My direction is south. S stands for south. I am east of you. E stands for east. I am west of you. W is for west. Hey, don't forget about northwest. Hey, don't forget about northeast. Last but not least, southeast. Hey, don't forget about southwest. No one ever remembers southwest. <laughs> well, Gators, those are all the directions. Bye. No matter what direction of town you live in, it's always nice to get a friendly greeting. You're right. K-Kid Club members are making Valentine for Visti. Let's learn more. K-Kids Club has been busy, busy, busy making Valentine's Day cards for Visti. Visti is an organization that helps elderly people. Austin, can you please read your Valentine's cards? Yes, I can. You're in my thoughts and heart wherever I may go. <laughs> On Valentine's, I'd like to say, I care more than you know. <laughs> oh, it's okay. It's all right. Yeah. Gators, if you can handle it, please join us in making Valentine's Day cards for the elderly people. Please make sure you turn in all of your cards to Mrs. Bartell by February 4th. You know, we need about 700 Valentines. We need to know how to count. Not a problem. Houston knows how to count. Let's go see him on his snake farm for our math minute. Hi, all the gators. Houston here for our math minute. When you got a lot of counting to do, it can help to count by twos. Why don't y'all help me count these snakes? Two, four, six, eight, ten. Whoa, whoa, that's too many snakes. Get out of here, you rascally reptiles. Houston, you've got a problem. Anna, why'd you change clothes? Because I have a birthday party to go to this week with some of my gator friends that are having birthdays. Well, that sounds like fun. Let's stay tuned for the pledges, gators. Happy birthday, gators!